Yo, what's up? Welcome to my channel again, Bird into Bird. I'm with my friend here. And yo, yo, you're gonna introduce yourself to them, bro. My name is Miro. Miro? You know, Miro in the Philippines is uh, a family name. Miro? Yeah. Oh. It's a family name. So, by the way, so we're in Jollibee right now, Queens. You need some help, by the way. Yeah, so <laughs> hold on. You know what? We eat inside the car because there's no dining in in Jollibee right now. So this is the chicken joy, bro. Mm -hmm. You wanna you wanna hold it up for me? Which one is yours here? This, Some I think this one is yours. Thing, probably. Yep. Uh huh. And you said, oh my god, which one? <laughs> I'm, so, I'm so confused right now. Like, just put it, put this one here. Yeah, all right. Um, okay, so. Just give me the trash if anything. Trash? Yeah, if you have any trash, I'll take it. You want it? There's, there's the sauce, your, that's a oh. barbecue sauce, right? So, we're eating jelly bean right now. We have spaghetti, we have the chicken joy, spicy one, and then we have the peach mango pie. What you got, bro? I got some tendies. The what? Tenders. The tenders? Yeah, Can you show it to them? I got you. Oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, so, bro, I want you to try the peach mingo pie first. Oh. This is your first time, right? Yeah, I've never had it. First before. time, no, I mean like eating Jollibee, but it's your first time to eat uh, peach mingo pie. Yeah. yeah, so, so, so be careful because outside is like cold, but inside is really hot. Is. Yeah, so be careful. I don't want you to, you know, to call 911 for that. I got it. <laughs> Show yourself in the camera, man. How do you find it? That's good. That's really fun, good. <laughs> <laughs> but this is supposed to be like outdoor eating, like spaghetti, chicken. Yeah. And this is a dessert. But it's alright. So actually, we can you explain to them like what what, what we did uh, earlier? So we were in bouldering. Boulder? Bouldering. Bouldering. Yeah. That's a uh, rock climbing, right? Kind of like rock climbing, just without a harness. Yeah, but it's not as high. my yeah. first time doing it uh, doing like rock climbing it's not like pretty like high it's yeah. just like what's the the, the hmm. what's the goal for that one it's just like for fun right yeah you you're know, not really like you're you're trying to no it's just kind of like having fun you know learning how to climb mm -hmm. get like some technical skill just kind of learning and having fun that's it really it's also a bit of an exercise yeah you know it's actually a good um, good core exercise. What I feel right now is... <laughs> what I actually feel right now is my body's um, is a little bit sore. My arms, my forearm, my, my bicep and triceps. But it's a good exercise. You gotta, the legs, you gotta eat a little bit more next time. Yeah, so, that was like, um, uh, activity actually, and he's trying to, you know, to, to introduce me with that, with that rock climbing. And it was fun. What you got right now, bro? I think you might need this, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> bro, you already got the chicken, right? I mean, they, before you touch your tinder, I want you to try this um, this original chicken from, um, like this is the, the spicy one. I like spicy. Yeah. Let's try it and show it to them. Oh, damn, it has a little flag on it. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Look at that. that chicken wing. It's a big wing. So this is just a introduction to my my vlog, but 
I'm gonna do a vlog when we go there uh, for the second time. Mm. I'm just waiting for my GoPro. I just ordered today. Yeah, yeah bro. Like, I need to invest it because I need to upload more videos on my YouTube channel. Mm. Like, I don't, I didn't get like much money anymore because almost two years I didn't, I didn't upload any videos. So I wanna start, I wanna start again. You like it? It's really good. No, I after the one, I also want you to try the, the spaghetti. I've had the spaghetti before. Oh, you like it? That I've had. That's good. Yeah. I had that on the uh, the burger steaks last time. That was burger good. steak? Yeah, I had that last uh, time here. Last uh, you 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 ate the rice with the burger steak or what? Yeah. Oh, that's good. So I got one. Let's eat. Oh wow. Mm. Mm -hmm. Better than the other product, right? Yeah, I mean, I like it more than like Popeye. Popeye's, right? Yeah. You like Popeye? I like this more. Mmm. <laughs> Yo, um, do you have any YouTube channel? Me? No. I don't have anything to do that. You wanna like... Like sign up, just start signing it up. So... My... My followers and subscribers will also follow you in your YouTube channel. Mm. Just to start off. I'd have to make one then. Yeah, you have to. Because we're gonna do vlog together. And then we're gonna convince them to follow you. Jeez. And then when you when you reach like two thousand or one thousand to two thousand subscribers, you can monetize your YouTube channel. And then that's the time when you monetize your YouTube channel, you can get money from from YouTube. YouTube's hard. Oh, I just realized we have the same cup. <laughs> yeah. YouTube's hard, dude. It's hot? Hard. The what? YouTube? I feel mm. like it's a little tough. It's, it's hard uh, in the sense that you need to, to think uh, a, a good content. Yeah. You know, it's very hard. And by the way, guys, my my followers, my Kaka Good community, like, I didn't upload any videos for almost two years right now. Aww. But my youtube channel is still growing you know i already have like 30,400 subscribers and yeah i'm still getting like money but not really that much it's just like it's all right you know because i'm not doing anything because of my work being an artist in the usa right now it's a pretty tough it's a, a very hectic uh, schedule Aww. but i'm trying to to give time for my youtube channel and for 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 all of you and now I have my friend right now. I think it's very nice to have a good content with this guy. Show sure to show sure, show sure them the the tender chicken sauce. I don't know if you can see. It's a little bright. <laughs> the little sauce cups too. Go. You see it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mm. That's your uh, pineapple juice. Mm. It's nice barbecue. It's like M pineapple barbecue. Mustard and barbecue, right? Yeah. Actually, we don't have that mustard sauce in the Philippines. Mm. The only made that one here in the USA. But actually, the chicken is uh, like almost the same. The taste is almost the same back home in the Philippines. Mm -hmm. But the size of the serving, mm -hmm. it's I think it's bigger. The chicken is bigger than here. Yeah. The chicken in the Philippines is bigger than this mm -hmm. one. Yeah. I don't know because maybe we have a lot of poultry there. 
maybe. Yeah, and it's like pretty cheap. And this like Filipino spaghetti is like sweet. Yeah. So I don't think white people like sweet spaghetti. They they used to eat like how do you call this one? Like a tomato sauce, something like that. Well, I know it's pretty good. Which one? When well, I had the spaghetti it was pretty good. But it is a little sweet. Yeah, if you have like if you have a sweet thought, maybe it works. I need these carbs because I think I lose like 1,500 calories today from rock climbing. <laughs> so I'm gonna I'm gonna like try to upload together with this video later. Just add it in. It. <laughs> yeah. We're looking for workers over there though. Which one? Jolly Jolly Bee? Yeah. Oh, you wanna you wanna play? <laughs> Not me. I don't have time. Huh? I don't have time, but like everywhere is looking for workers and it's crazy. But your work, you said your, your work is good, right? Yeah. In the, in the bar? Yeah, it's not bad, you know? Yeah, nice, it's a lot, a, lot of, a lot of money in there, actually. I have my friend, actually, he's, he's a Filipino and he's, work, he's a bartender, but mm. he's a bunker, but he, have a, he has this um, part-time job, mm -hmm. Saturday and Sunday, or Friday and Saturday in the bar. He does bartending, and then his, he told me like after after the end of the night, yeah. he got like eight hundred just for the tips. Yeah, excluding the the, the hourly rate. Yeah, bartending is really good. Yeah, wow. For I said, night? Like, yeah, just that yeah. like you just like longer hours. Like sometimes it's until like four a.m. or whatever. You know? Yeah. It's a little annoying, but he finishes like around five o'clock mm -hmm. in the morning. Yeah. So that means like you start at nine o'clock until five o'clock. So already like got a lot of bills. I mean like tips. Yeah. It's good money, man. Eh? I want to quit nursing. I want to do bartending now. <laughs> <laughs> nursing is good, dude. Mm. Nursing is good, but the stress level is just like 150 percent all the time. But it's part of it. What off floor are you on? I work in an operating room. Mm. I'm a perioperative nurse. Okay. It's fun. Like stress is always there everywhere. Uh, it's 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 up to you how, how you manage it, how you handle it. Mm -hmm. It's starting to rain right now. You see a lot of crazy shit, huh? Mm-hmm. Why are you taking taking uh, what course are you taking right now? I mean a uh, biochem. Biochem. Oh uh, yeah, you want a scientist, right? Yeah, I want to do research, which is pretty fun. But you know how it goes. Yeah. Slowly but surely, I'll get there. Yeah. You got it. I know you're smart. Is there any board exam after that? Hmm? Huh? Is there any board exam? You're gonna take a, a exam like to to to, to be a registered by um, something? Yeah, if you wanna like when you get your PhD. Oh yeah, yeah. You need to get that. Oh, that's a that's a prerequisite because you wanna you wanna be a doctor, <laughs> something like that. It's not it's not bio bi biology biochem right? Mm -hmm. Oh, you say biochem now? Yeah. <laughs> My team is different. Yeah, you wouldn't be like a medical doctor, but you have a doctorate. Mm -hmm. But okay, it's more on research. This is the garbage, right? Mm -hmm. How was your uh, chicken tender, man? Take the last one. No, 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 take it. I'm good. I still have chicken in here. I still have a lot of pieces in here. We need to finish this one. So how do you like it? This is good. 
You never tried like uh, Filipino dishes before, right? I had um one pasta dish. It was like these really thin noodles. I'm forgetting what it was called. Pancit, bumpy, like what thin noodles is that? Like how I don't did they were like almost see through. See what? Like they were almost see through. Oh, like maybe you. maybe maybe that sutang hon. Maybe I don't know. Bumpy. <laughs> then how did how did he cook it? How did he prepare it? I don't know. Honestly, <laughs> I was mad hungry. I was at one of my friends' house. A Filipino friend? Yeah. Is it dry? Is it oily? A little oily. Hmm. Maybe that's a pancit canton or the bumpy. The bumpy is together with the. That noodles, uh, you said the see-through noodles, mm -hmm. and that like the yellow one, and then put it together, um, and then mix it with the vegetables, mix it with shrimp, something like that, and and pork meat or chicken meat, whatever it is. And the other one, the yellow noodles, like we uh, call it like canton. So how was it? Is it good? Yeah, <laughs> I can eat a bucket of that. <laughs> <laughs> So there's a lot of Filipino restaurants here along this area. We're actually in the Queens uh, Boulevard in Jollibee. So next time we're gonna go to um, we're gonna do mukbang. You know mukbang? Mukbang is a Filipino term for for uh, eating a vlog um, food vlog. <laughs> like like have this particular food uh, like bulk of, of food like let's say like a Filipino food and then. We're just eating uh, in front of the camera. Huh. And try to taste the try to taste the the viewers. Huh. We're gonna eat and explain to them how it tastes. How do you like? Just like a review food, food review. Grab some chicken, bro. I'm done. Like the... I'm done. Yeah, me too. I honestly can't eat more. <laughs> Is that garbage, right? Uh -huh. Yeah. So I'm gonna like save this one for later. And I can finish this. Are you sure? Some napkins? Yeah. Thanks, man. <sighs> no. Thanks for the juice. Oops. Oh, we also have pineapple juice here. The original Jollibee pineapple juice. Oh, we'll slip it. Yeah. I don't want to open this one again. Oh, like, inside of my car, it's like, it looks like a garbage right now. I can hold on to it. Which one? Hey, it's alright. Where's the... Where? Oh, we only have one plastic, right? I have this one. Mm. I have this one, but like, it's kind of ripped because they put tape. That's right. It has a hole. So, alright, so we're done eating actually. We still have a lot of chicken left in here. <laughs> I didn't feel this my Jollibee because I'm like, pretty full right now. So how do you feel it, man? I feel pretty full. <coughs> Excuse me. That was really good, honestly. This thing's really good also. It's really nice and sweet. <laughs> this juice? Yeah. Everything's been really fucking good. Everything is good. I don't know. Everything's delicious, good. honestly. <laughs> so alright, thank you so much, guys. Thank you for watching this video. And then, yeah, that's it for now. And then I'm gonna upload this video on my YouTube channel. And then some pictures and videos from rock climbing. And then I have this man here, M. Um, and then he gonna he gonna be with me like some vlog soon. Yeah. All right. Say goodbye to them, bro. Yup. See you guys later. Till next time. All right. Bye bye.